Hail is something we get a lot of in the summer, but how do you get chunks of ice when it can be 90 degrees outside? Well, it all has to do with the dynamics of a thunderstorm and temperatures way up in that storm. Of course, you don't have to go very far up, only about three, four miles, even in the summer, to get below freezing in a storm cloud. You need a strong updraft, air that's moving upwards into the thunderstorm, pushing that hail further and further up and keeping it buoyant. It's that updraft that is key to creating hail. Without that, snowflakes would melt quickly and fall to the ground as raindrops. But because that updraft can keep that ice floating, keep super cooled water droplets falling and condensing on it, that hail can get bigger and bigger. And what that tells us is how strong that storm is or how strong that updraft is. The larger the hail, the larger the updraft to sustain it. Up to softball size hail, means 103 mile per hour winds sustaining that ice until finally it gets so heavy that it falls to the ground and does a lot of damage.